Hey DIY decorators, if you are anything like me, you have boxes of trim, rhinestone, glass pieces, buttons, beads, you name it. And I hate to throw any of that stuff away. So today on Make Your Mark, we are making a crazy mosaic feather. And instead of using tile grout, we're gonna be using glaze coat resin on top. It's gonna look super cool and I'm really excited to make this piece. Now before I forget, thumbs up if you like this video and leave me a comment if you have a question about this project or you just wanna say hi. And you know how much I love it when you say hello. Are you ready? Let's make a crazy mosaic feather. I love a mosaic project, especially when I don't have to use grout and the pieces don't have to be perfectly fit together. This project allowed me to use leftover pieces of broken glass, buttons, trim, glass marbles, and even some craft tiles left over from another project. The key is to use whatever you have because the colorful base will make it look amazing. Just a quick reminder to thumbs up if you like this video and leave me a comment if you have a second. I love hearing from you. I really do. You'll notice that I switched to E6000 Plus for the acrylic gems, and that's because it doesn't corrode plastic. It works perfectly with these gems. The earliest known examples of mosaics were found at a temple building in Abra, Mesopotamia and are dated to about 2500 BC. They consist of pieces of colored stones, shells, and ivory. Cover your feather with a large box or keep it in a dust-free room overnight while the resin cures. I'm gonna leave a link to Unicorn Spit and Glaze Coat in the description below. Thumbs up if you like this video, leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and press that notification bell so you know I have a new video. Grab any one of my craft books, I'm gonna leave a link below to those as well and I will see you next week. Bye.